This video covers the end for end splice procedure for Yale Cordage high performance single braids. Begin by laying out the two ends of your rope to be spliced. Using an appropriately sized fid, make a first eye mark in accordance with the rope type. This video shows type 2 products with the first eye mark made three and one short fid lengths from the end of the rope. From the end of the rope, mark adjacent strands at one and one short fid lengths. Continue forming your taper by marking the fourth strand pair as well as a single end at the ninth strand pair. Using your taper tool or a sharp knife, cut your taper marks and extract the cut strand ends. Using a rope cutter or a sharp knife, cut the tapered ends of your rope at 45 degrees and tape them tightly. Insert the tapered end of the rope into the hollow end of the fit, securing it with tape tightly. Pass the fit through the center of the opposite rope at the crossover mark. Be careful not to split any of the strand ends and pass the fit only through the center of the rope. For a 12 strand rope, there should be six strands on either side of the fit at this point. Pull the rope through until the crossover marks align. Form your first brummel by passing the opposite fit through the center of the rope. Form an additional brummel by passing the fit through the center of the rope three picks down from the location the rope previously exited. Complete the first half of the splice by inserting the fit into the hollow center of the rope, three picks down from the previous brummel. Continue working the fit down the length of the rope until the entire tail is buried. Repeat this process on the other side of the splice by forming a brummel three picks down for the point where the tail exits the splice. Bury the tail of the splice by inserting the fit back into the hollow center of the rope three picks down from the previous brummel. Continue working the fit along the length of the rope until the entire tail is buried inside the splice. Unravel the end of the rope and use your rope cutters or a sharp knife to cut a gradual taper pattern along the length of the tail. Repeat the taper on the opposite side of the splice.
milk out sleeve slack to bury both ends of the splice. Once the splice is complete, perform two whip locks located four inches apart on either side of the center of the splice. Refer to the whip lock instructions at the end of the industrial single braid eye splice video.